Oh, this feels nice. Good morning, guys. How are you doing today? I hope you're having an awesome day. Wow, it's been a whole week since I've even turned this camera on. And I have to say, I feel, I feel home. I feel like I'm home. Um, yeah, it's really weird and really nice. I've missed you guys so much. I, I have just not had the time to film at all due to this course starting on Monday. I am very, very excited about it. And I honestly, I honestly can't wait. Uh, I've been, I finally put it on Facebook that I'm doing it. And a couple of my mates were like, Daz, you, you wouldn't be a very good counsellor. And I'm like, why is that? And, and he was going, well, one, you're too funny. Right? Um, two, I don't think people would take you seriously. Now, as I was trying to explain to him, yes, people prob probably wouldn't take me seriously. Um, um, unfortunately, when I've actually become a counsellor, I can't actually counts counsel counsel yeah any of my friends or anyone i know uh, that's one of the what's that's one of the rules of being a counselor you see i would have to counsel someone that that doesn't know me um people would take me seriously due to the fact that they don't really know me and i would be very professional about it anyway and the the, the whole thing he was saying about me being funny was i i think in my head anyway um I think it would make the person feel more relaxed if I was to be a little bit funny, if I was to be me, you know, I'm not, I've already said I'm not going to be doing this suiting and booting malarkey, I'm not going to be wearing a suit or anything like that, I will literally be going in comfortable clothes, maybe not like this, but smart clothes, um, I want, at the end of the day, I want my client to open up to me, I want my client to be able to trust me enough to open up to me, so therefore if I'm myself, and if I'm not dressed, you know, formally, people are more likely to open up to you. Um, so, yeah, I think me being funny might might be might be a bit of an advantage for me, to be honest. But yeah, I haven't actually filmed for a week, and I'm I'm really happy about that. No, wait, that sounds wrong. I'm really happy I'm back filming. Wow. Uh, yeah, this week I've literally just been going through all the paperwork, all the. Um, the materials and stuff for this course and um, yeah I think I'm ready guys I think I think I'm ready it's a little bit of a head wreck already but I think I'm gonna yeah I'm ready I'm ready plus side I've had a new floor put down in the bedroom this week um, due to the carers were starting to, to struggle using the the hoist you know the thing that gets me out of my chair they were struggling as the floor wasn't quite smooth so I've had new flooring put down which is a lot better for the carers. Um, the hoist moves so easy now, it's literally like it's on ice. Um, so they're happy about that, I'm happy about that. It got put down professionally, so it's, there's no gaps or anything like there is in the lounge. But we'll sort that out another day. I wanted to show you guys something, right? I came across this little gadget on uh, the Tinterweb, okay? And you guys might have heard of it, you might not have heard of it, but it's called wireless charging for a phone, tablet, laptop. And I want to show you how it works, because this makes my life so much goddamn easier. Hello guys. Right, so, this is my phone, and this here, <gasps> and this here is a wireless charging dock. You can't actually see me, unfortunately, but hey ho. Um, and how this works is, you put your phone on top of it, like so, and there it is charging. How awesome is that? And how it works is, I've actually got a broken one here I can show you. Is this thing here, right? I actually broke this off another case so I could show you guys. Uh, but all it is is copper wiring. And that sits on the back of your phone, like that. So it would sit like, like that on the back of your phone. Unfortunately, the connector you plug into your phone has broken. So that would sit there, like that. And then it would plug into the bottom of your phone. Unfortunately, it broke. So, um, yeah, it literally, I've bought a case that's built in 
with that um, copper coil in it. And all it does is plugs in the bottom of your phone like that. And you can actually unplug it. Which you, enables you to plug it in the wall if you want to. So that is literally just built into the case as you can see. So yeah, it's quite handy that way. And all it does is just have to plug it back in. And all it does is the copper wiring connects with this and this sends a signal to the copper wiring which then sends that signal to the phone charger port and then that's how it charges your phone. And for me just to be able to put it on there like that and it charges your phone is so much goddamn easier for me. It lights up blue when it's charging and it'll go green when it's charged. But for me just to be able to plop that on top and it charges the phone is awesome. Uh, the only thing does, it does get a little bit warm. Um, but if you ever felt the back of your phone when it's charging it plugged in with a cable it doesn't get much hotter than that really um, they do recommend don't put it on your bedside cabinet just in case anything goes wrong and because it can it can it can overheat but my luckily touch wood mine hasn't overheated so uh, yeah I'll actually put the links in the description below if you want to go and get yourself one um, I bought that for well I, had to, I, end up, I ended up buying two um, because I accidentally bought the iPhone 7 Plus case when mine's an iPhone 7. So um, I ended up taking that apart. Purpose for this video today so I can show you guys what was inside it. And you can just buy the coil that you can just slip into the back of your normal phone case. Plug it into the bottom of your phone and you can do it that way. But I like things to look neater and tidier so I actually bought the case with the copper wiring built in. But you can just buy the copper wiring. Um, I think they're only about, at the end of the day, it's only a receiver. So they're about a pound um, on eBay. But I'll put all the links you guys need in the description below. So if you want to go and get yourself a wireless charger, feel free to get yourself a wireless charger. Also, guys, I've been thinking over the last couple of days, I want to do something with my hallway. Because... This, I think this is the only room and the spare room that I haven't actually touched yet, paint-wise. I know the camera's on a bit of an angle, my big, big thingy's kind of broke as you can see, it's wobbling. Um, but that wall where the mirror is, I actually want to get rid of that mirror and I want to put almost like, it's hard to explain it, I might have to insert a picture into the, into the video, but it's more like a load of picture frames, they're all different sizes, they're all going to be really close together. That type of thing. I really want to put that there. Um, I will be reusing the mirror. I'll show you that in a second. But where this shelf is here, I want to get rid of that, and I want to have either different size floating float float. Yeah, that's the right word. Floating shelves. Um, I want kind of three different sizes so they can go above each other. Uh, I think that would look pretty cool. And with this mirror, uh, when I got this mirror, actually, my mom bought me this mirror. And she said it wasn't, It's uh, to be fair, it said on the box, do not put on a wall. I got it on a wall, it's fine, it works. So, um, depending if there's another bracket at the side, I want to put it landscape and put it over, if I turn around slowly, I want to be able to put it on this wall here along the door where the picture frames are, uh, in landscape mode. Landscape mode, that's not, I'm talking camera talk now, Daz. Um, I want to be able to put that mirror in landscape. I think that would look really nice there. And I want to give it a bit of a lick of paint, you know? It's it's the same manky magnolia as it's always been. Look at that, it's, it's not very good. And there's my signed picture of Anton Deck, just in case you uh, in case you want to know. So that's that. I want to be able to get that decorated. Um, it's going gonna, it's gonna to take a bit of money, I think. But also, I'm planning another trip. Um, earlier on, well the next couple of months, I want to go back home to where I used to live. So that's going to happen as well, hopefully. There's a lot going on this year. Um, I made a thing last year that I want to be able to go travelling a bit more this year. 
So that's what I want to do, you know? And there's no point telling there's no point saying it and not doing it. So I want to try and do a bit a bit, a bit more travelling this year. Uh, fair enough it will only be to the UK. But that's a start. I'm off the Isle of Man. So yeah, plan of action today is nothing, as it is peeing down again. It was peeing down all day yesterday, but I wasn't that bothered because I was feeling a little bit fluey yesterday. I'm still feeling a little bit today, but I kept going hot and cold, hot and cold. Evie was Evie's not been very well the past few days. She was puking a bit. Um, she's been living off rice and scrambled egg, and a little wee bit of carrot for a bit of crunch for the last two days. Two days, yeah and she's not puked at all she generally looks and feels a little better so she's been introduced to a little bit of her normal food again today with some scrambled eggs so hopefully touch wood she'll keep that down and yeah the Bartley household has just been it's just been sicky to be honest past few days I've been going hot and cold all the time um, yesterday was quite funny actually um, I just planned nothing no mates were coming around i just sat in front of the tv and watched a whole series of the walking dead and i had the blanket over me and um, my hood was over my head just so i could just see the tv enough because i was feeling really cold and every time i put the blanket on evie would try and pull it off thinking i wanted it off so we had a bit of a battle with the blanket to be honest um, she did get it off at one point and put it over herself. Yep, accidentally, but it looks so cute. <laughs> but uh, yeah, uh, I'm feeling a little bit better today, though, guys. I'm still feeling. I'm feeling like I don't want to. It sounds horrible, but I'm feeling a bit like sweaty but cold. If you know what I mean. Um, my Karen took the temperature this morning, and it's it's the normal. She felt my forehead, and it was normal. But uh, I'm just feeling a little bit sweaty, or sticky, so to speak, not sweaty. Uh, but I'm still feeling quite cold, so I don't know what's happening. I don't know, but I'm, I'm feeling a little bit better today. I woke up with toothache as well. God, this vlog's just moaning, isn't it? I do apologise, guys. But it's been a week, you know, there's a lot of, ca not, a lot of catching up to do. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I found a bit of toothache this morning as well, so I took some ibuprofen. And then I took some paracetamol to take my temperature down. And uh, yeah, it's all good. It's all good. Two things going ish. And then hopefully I'll stop feeling so sticky. But yeah, that's that. That's that. That's that's my week, guys. Not really done anything. But uh, yeah, I feel like I'm talking a little bit more than I would usually in these vlogs. I think it's because I've missed it, you know? Oh, I forgot to mention about the hallway. How did I forget to do that? I'm thinking of actually getting a load of fairy lights and putting them in the hallway because as you guys know you've seen in the vlogs my hallway is extremely dark unless I have the light or the lamp on and yeah I'm gonna get some fairy lights and put them in the corners of the, of the um, you know where the mirror is now I'll turn it around for you in the, the corners going up down the wall so I'm gonna put some there um, the, the under the stairs cupboard I have I'm gonna put lights going up there so it's gonna look pretty cool it's gonna look it might look a bit like a runway when I open the door but we'll see. We'll see what it looks like. We'll just have to, just have to play around with it. Well, guys, just, I just had Evie out for a quick walk. Let me just pause this. Yeah, I was watching them. Only feels and horses. Just got back from taking Evie out for a walk. While the rain was eased, it wasn't stopped, but it was eased. And I'm now just having a a wrap for my lunch. Left leftover food from yesterday. Uh, last night I ended up cooking myself chicken, um, vegetables, i.e. broccoli, cauliflower, pepper, and green beans, and um, um, what are they called? The mini sweet corn things. Don't know what they're called. All fried up with a bit of cream cheese. It was gorgeous. I had some leftover, so I'm just having it, having it in a wrap while watching. Um, only Fools and Horses on gold. Oh yeah, if you see my husband there uh, on the screen, that's Mr. Chalam Tatum. He is my husband-to-be. Doesn't know it yet, but he will be. I feel like death, I'm not gonna lie. I thought I'd, um, I was quite cold before, so I just chucked this, this, uh, don't know what you call it, poncho thing on. 
out of the wardrobe I had and I'm like hot and then cold, I'm just not feeling it, you know. I'm also rocking the, uh, the uh, slipper, the slipper look also, I have two pairs of slippers on. No, no, that's a lie, I can't even think. I have two pairs of slipper socks on and a pair of slippers on top of that. My poncho is stuck in my belt. Hold on a second. Let's see if I can get it out. Ooh. This is why it's handy to have fingers that work, guys. <laughs> okay. Right, leave, leave, leave. Good girl. No, uh, uh, leave. Good girl, right, move it that way. No, leave, move, leave, 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 leave. <laughs> As you can see, guys, she's trying to help me. But yeah, I've got it out now. Ah, no, 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 no. I know it looks like I want it off, darling, but I don't want it off, okay? I'm cold. That's exactly what she was trying to do yesterday with the whole blanket thing. I was get the blanket on me. She thought I needed it off, but uh, yeah, as you can tell, she's trained to take clothes off and on, so I think that's what she thought I was trying to do. And uh, as you've just seen, I don't ask her now. She kind of knows, which is handy, but at this time I didn't want it off. But she just helped me get it out the last bit of my belt. Guys, I'm like hot, but I'm cold, if you know what I mean. Is that normal? So she's starting to course tomorrow. Um, yeah, I'm literally just having... Frey Bentos pie for my tea tonight. And uh, vegetables, I think it was. I, I really cannot, like, focus or anything. My mind's just, like, all over the place. Um, but, yeah. I've been drinking plenty of water. I've been on these all day. The, uh, the I don't know what they're called now. Fleet, was it? That, that water bottle there. I've been on that. Game, that's what it's called. Um, I've been on that all day. I've had about five of those refilled. I've been taking paracetamol to try and keep my temperature down, but as I said, at the same time, I'm hot and then like my feet are freezing, my legs are freezing, my body's cold, but my head's like roasting. So I'm trying to put as much layers as I can on because you're supposed to starve a flu. Is it starve a flu and feed a cold? I might just sit on Facebook for 10-15 minutes and then feed Evie, have my tea and then do nothing all night. I might just watch a bit of um, The Walking Dead again. Uh, I did just nip out by myself to go to the shop and it is bloody windy outside and I hope I can say bloody. I hope I can say bloody. YouTube friendly and all that. YouTube child friendly and all that. But uh, yeah, it's freezing outside, so I won't be going out again tonight unless I have to, or my mate, or I go around to my friends later on. But I don't think I will, because it's not fair on them if I'm ill and I pass it on to them. But uh, yeah, that's that. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, look at this. My friend has just dropped round for me. How cute is that? Friends. Friends are always here to warm your heart. Oh, isn't that a little cute? Little flower on top. That is adorable. I ended up watching a movie and, and nodding off and then I got a text from my friend saying she's got something for me, she's coming round. So that was nice of her. Currently just watching a programme about about the Queen. Oh, it's just finished. It's just finished. Uh, that banging you just heard, guys, was the, was the wind. It's really windy outside, like really windy outside, and it's peeing down as well. Guys, I'm still spaced, man. I don't know what it is. I've got a really itchy eye as well, and I really squint it. It like hurts. So, I don't know what you're all thinking. Don't squint it then, Daz. Don't squint it. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to end this vlog here in a minute, as my car is going to be here in just over an hour's time. I'm not going to be doing anything now, unfortunately. I'm not going to lie, I, I can't wait to get to bed tonight. I can't wait to get to bed. <laughs> this is actually my last vlog before I start my, my new chapter in my life, so to speak. New course, 
new course, the first course I've ever actually done in an open uni. So uh, yeah, I'm, I'm a little bit nervous about it, but I'm also really excited about it too. Uh, yeah, I'm actually quite looking forward to it, you know. But uh, it's gonna be, it's gonna be long, and it's gonna. I think it will be difficult because there's a lot of things you need to know. Uh, I can't really go into it because it it's mashed my head trying to trying to understand everything. But I've got a whole year to do it in. And as I said, I promise you guys that I will still be in touch through YouTube. Um, uh, yeah, I'm pretty much, I'm not going anywhere. Oh, no, I've got a crack in my mirror at the bottom. <gasps> I just noticed that. Oops. Oops. Anyway, yeah, so I won't be going anywhere. Um, I will still be doing videos for you guys, so don't worry about me not uploading anything for you I will be doing some sort of some sort of vlog you might just hear about my course how it's going and yeah I'm gonna end this vlog video, 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 video let's start again I'm gonna end this vlog here so thank you guys so much for watching <laughs> start that again two sets okay thank you guys so much for watching this video if you liked it, smash that like button down below. Even if you didn't enjoy this video, smash that like button down below. All my social media accounts and fan mail address are in the description below. If it's the first time you've seen my ugly mug on your screen, please make sure you hit that subscribe button. Turn the notifications bell on as well. You'll then get notified when I upload my next video. But thank you guys so much for watching. I love you all to death. And don't forget... To keep it wheeling. Good night, guys. Good night.